Hello, it's Chris Voss here from thechrisvossshow.com, thechrisvossshow.com. Come with a cool device from Nusi. This is their HDMI dock for iPad 2. You can use it for a myriad of other iOS devices, but uh, for a large part, it acts as a stand for the iPad 2 and a dock system that will work with your HDMI TV. Let me give you some details about this. You can find it at newsyapple.com. That's uh, newsyapple.com. Com, and there'll be a link below the video you can take and click on. Now basically what this will do when you plug in your iOS device to it, it will give you a mirroring function, mirroring everything from the new iPad, so this works with iPad 3 generation, iPad 2, the original iPad, and iPad 4S to HDTV, it will transmit. It does HDMI, transmitting the HD signal, and uh, it'll also do for the iPod Touch 4G and the iPod 4, or iPhone Four and 4S. It's got a remote controller that's inside of it, it's play, pause, uh, all that good stuff. Audio line out, you can connect to a sound speaker for it. And charging, once you connect your Apple uh, adapter to the stock, it will charge your phone while playing an HD movie. So that's really great, you can get that experience. And it has a USB interface. And uh, it's pretty cool. So uh, let's take a look at uh, how it works and we'll break open the packaging here. Now it says here that you can use this with like I said, iPhone 4, iPad Touch 4th generation, mirroring everything uh, with the remote controller to your HD display. You can see on the back kind of how that works. And so, you know, if you don't want to be spending a lot of money to upgrade, uh, being able to put your mirroring and, and different things, software, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, to go to HD TV, this is a very viable solution. And it's from Nusi. So let's take a look. Uh, looks like we've got, you know, your normal standard directions on how to utilize it. Um, let's take a look. Looks like we have a cute little uh, nice to find uh, looks like a remote control. So we've got a remote control that we can use to uh, be able to power it, which is really nice. So basically you got a channel changer for your uh, for your uh, uh, this iPad. Uh, looks like you got next, charge, power, replay, enter really cool you got complete control over it so we'll go ahead and set that aside and then uh, let's take a look at the unit here looks like it's pretty self-inclusive on the unit looks like in the front we have an IR uh, area where of course it receives its signal looks like we've got a protector on the iPad case and of course this is where you would put your iOS device and it also acts as a stand you've got a power button here that's uh, much like the power button you have on a uh, Apple device so very cool simple and easy to use nothing down the side one thing in the bottom you can feel it's a nice rubberized bottom that's going to protect whatever surface you put on and also make sure it doesn't slide off looks like on the back here we've got a line out audio plug looks like we've also got HDMI uh, so that will do your HDMI out and looks like we also have a USB plug-in and I believe this is going to be an SD cable maybe or a, I'm not sure what this is so we'll figure this out but uh, we're going to go ahead and play with the device and get a good idea as to how it works and what it does and we're going to get back to you on what we think of it after we use it Hi folks, okay, so we've gotten a chance to get to know the NewsyApple.com's HDMI uh, connector dock uh, for your iOS devices. Uh, found it works great with everything, iPad 2, the iOS devices, the iPhone, uh, iPod 4 generation. Uh, the one thing we found is it will charge the iPad 3, uh, but as, of course, it doesn't specify this in the box, but it won't work uh, with the volume for some reason on the iPad 3, so we don't know why that was taking place but it doesn't say on the box that it works with the iPad 3. So just to make that note uh, that if you have an iPad 3, uh, you may want to check on the device and see if they've updated it at the time you order it. So what this has is it has a flip-up pull-up mount that locks in position that's made to hold your large iPad into it. And what this will do is fold down when you want to put your iPod or your iPhone into it and uh, easily plug that in and away you go. It has a charging button in the back that you can press that this will uh, you know, activate the charging system. You've got the IR uh, thing that will read the remote control here in the front and then you'll see a little orange light come on on the right side to tell you when it's charging your devices. Uh, some of the things we learned about reading the manual, of course we usually do an unboxing and, 
and uh, fly by the seat of our pants so you can see the unboxing. But this is the line out for the product. This is the HDMI out for the product. Uh, this powers with a 30 pin connector cord that you get with your iOS devices. And you just plug it into the back of your Macintosh or your power button uh, that you may have, uh, your power supply, I should say. Uh, just plug it right in there and it will power the device and charge your stuff. Uh, there's also a spare USB cords, so if you have multiple iOS devices, you can charge them as well. So, very cool design there. And uh, with the remote control, uh, it pretty much will control your songs, uh, plug, play, or pause, play, uh, previous, next, reward, uh, or forward, rewind, reward. I'm just making up my own words now. Uh, the menu, enter, uh, replay buttons, enter, all that stuff. I guess there's a menu that works with the iPod 4G uh, that does not work with the iPhone or the iPad. We were a little confused by that, but we clarified that. So um, you can use that with the iPod 4G. So be sure to check it out. It seems to work great uh, with everything we plugged it into and uh, really enjoy the new C Apple products. They have, of course, a plethora of other products you want to check out on their website. Be sure to check into them. We've reviewed a couple on the ChrisVossShow.com. You can see them also if you search in related searches. Thanks for coming by. Be sure to check back often.